In the attic of his home in Aldborough in Norfolk, Peter Rice is putting the finishing touches to his mighty, magnificent mural. With a career spanning six decades, Peter is noted for his work at the Royal Opera House, the Old Vic and Glyndebourne. But his latest work is not only big, but a big challenge. When he agreed to do it, he thought he'd rattle it off in a couple of months. Instead, it's taken a year. It's not like scene painting, where you do a rough impression uh, and it looks wonderful from a distance, but not so good from close to, because I soon realised I had a painting that people were going to get very up close to, and I, my old scene painting technique didn't really work, so I had to work out a totally new way of working. The painting has been commissioned by Peter's son, the author, painter and designer Matthew Rice, who's married to pottery queen Emma Bridgewater. It'll hang in their pottery in Stoke-on-Trent and is full of local landmarks thrust into a whimsical world. Uh, he said what he would like would be a history of Stoke, uh, but as if it were in the Bahamas. Very, very eccentric indeed. So it's Stoke-on-Trent with all its industrial buildings and, uh, uh, and furnaces and, and things, uh, but it's as if it's in the Caribbean, so it's a fantasy. Peter is married to Pat Albeck, the textile designer. They're in their 80s now, but both still hard at work. Pat still designing tea towels for the National Trust. I think your wife will be delighted to have you back, won't she? Yes, I think I think she gets a bit bored with me disappearing for hours on end, really. You know, uh, and particularly when every time she comes up and looks at it, it doesn't look any different. So she <laughs> has no idea what I've been up to, really. Peter will be 85 in September. Time to dry off the paintbrushes, perhaps. Not a bit of it. He's already planning his next project, and it's just as big. Natalie Gray, ITV News, Aldborough, in Norfolk.